Welcome back to the Reflactor channel. You know, a couple of months ago on April 8th, a total solar eclipse swept across much of North America, including right here in the Dallas-Fort Worth area. Of course, you probably already knew about that, unless... Now, this video is going to be a little bit different from all the other solar eclipse videos that have been popping up. Because, for the most part, I won't be showing any direct images of the solar eclipse. But don't worry, during the brief period of totality, I did have three video cameras recording. One was recording the results of three of these solar reflectors. These project a pretty big image of the sun onto a wall for you to view. I have a video that shows how to build these really cheaply. I'll put a link down in the description box. The other camera was pointed out at the general neighborhood to catch all the effects of what happens during a total eclipse, such as the streetlights coming on, or maybe a change in the sound of the birds, and all that kind of good stuff. And a security camera caught a pretty cool image of the solar eclipse reflecting off of the windshield of my old Honda. I've put all these videos together on screen and playing in real time. Now, our total eclipse only lasted about a minute here. So this video is pretty short. I'm gonna play it once at regular speed and then once again at high speed so you can see all the effects happening pretty quickly. Let's watch. Okay, now it's really freaky. Here it comes. What time is it? 1.39. Here we go, less than a minute. Here we go. Okay, let's stand in there. Stop. Here it comes, you're going to see it, right? You look for the baby, please. Here it comes. It's gone. You can look at it without your glasses for about 30 seconds. Look at that. Holy. Wow. How dark that is. <laughs> look, you can see Jupiter. Look, that's Jupiter. Jupiter? Holy cow! That's the sun's atmosphere. I know you can only see it during a total eclipse. <laughs> So we're getting the bright edge. We're getting the bright edge. Oh, now you can. What did we get? About a minute? Yep. Mm -hmm. If you're enjoying this video, please push that like button. The shadow of totality was only about 120 miles wide. And the difference between 99% total and 100% total was quite literally night and day. I had heard people say that seeing the total eclipse in its full spectacular view was going to be life-changing. And I thought, really? But now that it's come and gone, I can say that I was overcome with a bit of a, a strange 
overwhelming emotion during the event. So much so that I didn't even take any still photos. We were pretty close to the edge, so totality only lasted about a minute, and I didn't want to waste any time fiddling with a camera. Thankfully, my wife did take a picture, and here's the one she got. I think it's pretty cool. Now, if you saw the total eclipse, please leave a message down in the comment section and tell me about your experience. Thanks for watching, and clear skies, everybody.